Hello everyone and welcome to your 10 days yoga challenge for beginners. My name is Natasha and thank you for joining me on day 7. So for today's practice, grab your mat, just observe your breathing and try to relax your body as much as you can. Work always within your limit and let's begin. Let's begin our practice by sitting on our knees. Your bones, spread your knees wider than your hips portion and actually on the length of your mat. Take a nice inhale, stretch your arms up, engage your stomach in, and then exhale, place your palms forward, stretch your arms all the way down. Try to keep your arms as wide as your shoulders. Bring your forehead on the ground, nose on the floor, and press your buttocks on the floor. Stay there. Try to push your chest towards the ground. One, try to breathe through your nose. Two, you inhale through the nose and you exhale through the nose. Four, and five. Take a nice inhale there. Exhale. Bring your palms closer to your body. Bring your knees, hips width apart. Take a nice inhale. Exhale, tilt your toes into the ground. Take a nice inhale, roll your shoulders back, engage your lower back, and then exhale, roll your spine, chin towards your chest. Take a nice inhale, roll your shoulders back into a half your cow stretch, and then exhale, in, 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 chin towards your chest, try to pull your stomach in. Take a nice inhale, look up, roll your shoulders back, engage your lower back. And then exhale in, 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 to the chest. Inhale, go back into the center. Exhale, bring your heels towards the floor. And stretch your palms forward if you feel like to create a nice 45 degrees angle between your upper body and your lower part of the body. Spread your fingers apart. Press your heels towards the floor. Try to maintain your knees super straight and push your chest towards the center of your mat without forcing and stimulating too much your shoulder blades. Stay there. One, two, three, close your eyes, four, and five. Take a nice inhale forward and then exhale. Bring your knees on the floor, extend your arms forward into Shashankasana. Inhale, go back into the center, and exhale, relax. Normalize your breath, your heart beats, and your blood flow. Slide and gently stand on the mat. Bring your feet hips width apart. Take a nice inhale, exhale, bring your arms on your hips, engage your pelvic floor. Inhale and then exhale, bend forward. Micro bend your knees if you feel like. Take a nice inhale, exhale, place your palms under your feet. Step on the top of your feet, but literally step on it, not on the tip of your fingers, on the top of your palms. Take a nice inhale, look up first, and then exhale, drop your head in. Intend to extend your legs lower by little in order to bring your feet as straight as possible. Stay there. One, two, keep breathing through your nose. Four, five. Inhale, exhale, release your arms into the center. Micro bend your knees if you need. Bring your feet all the way together and then exhale, bend your knees. Open your knees as wide as you can here and bring the back of your heels on the ground. Inhale, exhale, stretch your arms forward. Bring your chest to the center of your mat and your head down. Stay there into the last one. One, two, and three. Take a nice inhale forward. Exhale, release your knees on the floor and extend your legs forward. 
Bring your feet together, toes together, roll your shoulders back. Take a nice inhale, engage your toes, push the back of your knee on the floor, chin away from your chest, and then exhale, bend forward. Place your palms above your feet. Take a nice inhale, look up first, stay here for three breaths. Move your chest towards your knees. Try to avoid bubbling your upper spine. Try to make it as straight as possible and reach the sky into 45 degrees here. Head up. One, two, push your shoulders back. And three. And then exhale, bend forward, head down. Stay there. One, bend your elbows. Two, three, and three. Take a nice inhale, inhale. Now stretch your arms up and then exhale, release. Open your legs into Upanishad Kanasana Grace as wide as you can without forcing too much onto, inner, onto your inner thighs. Open your chest, engage your toes, take a nice inhale, stay here. I would like you to engage your inner ribs here all the way up. Chin away from your chest. One, two, and three. Exhale. Grab your big toes. If you can't grab your big toes, just grab the back of your knees. Take a nice inhale. Stay here for three. One, push your chest forward. Two, and three. And then exhale. Bend forward all the way down. Elbows up. One, two, and three. Take a nice inhale, head up, exhale, stretch your arms up, and then exhale, rise, grab your inner knees, and bring your legs into the center, and simply relax. Extend your legs forward, bend your knees, open your legs into Baddha Konasana. Grab your inner, here, very close to your ankles, grab your outer feet, roll your shoulders back and pull. Pull your chest totally forward, elbows a little bit closer to your ribs and bring your chin away from your chest and tend to bring, without forcing with your arms, tend to bring your knees to the floor. Close your eyes and try to make yourself taller and taller and taller and create some space between each and every vertebra. One, two, Push your chest forward. Three, try to even arch your lower back a little bit. Four and five. Inhale, exhale. Try to open your inner feet like a book. Bring your elbows on the top of your thighs. Try to push your inner outsole outside. Look up, inhale, and then exhale. Move forward all the way down and press your knees towards the floor with your elbows. One. Two, push your shoulders away from your ears. And three, take a nice inhale all the way up. Exhale. Inhale, bring your knees up. Exhale, extend them forward. And simply relax. Slide and gently open your eyes. And extend your legs forward. Take a nice inhale, bend your right knee. Exhale, open it in a halfway into 90 degrees. Roll your shoulders toward align within your hips. Engage your left toes. Inhale and then exhale. Bend forward, place your palms by the side. Inhale, head up and then exhale. Move forward into Janusha Sasana. Stay there. One, relax your neck. Two and three. Inhale, head up, exhale. Inhale, stretch your arms up, and then exhale. Bring your right knee up, and then exhale down. Let's go on the left. Inhale, and then exhale. Open it to 90 degrees. Create a nice and beautiful pressure with your left foot towards your right. Inhale, stretch your arms up. Shoulders and the hips in one line. Exhale, bend forward. Take a nice inhale. Engage your toes, look up, and then Exhale, bend forward. Stay there. Try to press the back of your knee on the floor. Two. Try to bring your chest towards your knee. And three. Inhale. 
inhale, exhale. Inhale, stretch your arms up. And then exhale down. Take a nice inhale. Bring your left knee up. Exhale down. And lay down. Into Shavasana. Lie down gently into Shavasana. Spread your feet slightly apart. Palms apart. Chin towards your chest. And simply begin to relax your entire body from top to the bottom and from bottom to the top. Observe your breathing. Observe each and every part of your body. Just try to calm down your mind, your heart beats, your blood flow. And simply relax your body. I would recommend you to stay here between five to ten minutes and I'll see you.